I'm here at Arab Health in Dubai and I'm here at the stand of uh, Dubai Biotechnology and Research Park and with me is the Business Development Director of Dubaiotech, Marwan Abdulaziz Janahi. Marwan, tell us about the Dubaiotech stat status now, how many companies are there in the park and uh, how many are you planning to, uh, are planning to set up? Right, so um, as of uh, 2011 we have got uh, 90 companies that have joined the park and they are in different sectors of biotechnology which are red, uh, white, green and also blue. 90 companies and uh, these companies are, please name some of them and uh, from which countries are they? So they're from around the world I would say. Uh, some of the big names that we have is Pfizer which is considered to be the number one pharmaceutical company which is a US company. Then there are uh, German companies as well uh, in addition to companies from India. So uh, and we have seen in 2011 for the first time companies from Turkey, South Korea and Brazil. So we're expecting uh, really interest from around the world. Do you see big institutions from uh, other new countries setting up uh, offices in uh, Dubai? Yes, we are currently undergoing uh, several negotiations with uh, big investors and companies that would like to have even a bigger presence uh, in the UAE to access the, the regional market of the Middle East. Okay, most of your companies are in the healthcare sector, so which other um, sectors of uh, biotechnology uh, do you plan to focus on this year? Well, in 2011, we have had uh, many companies that were from the food biotechnology area. Um, one of them is Firminic uh, and IFF, and these are really lead, uh, leading companies uh, in their areas of food biotechnology. Uh, another company is called National Starch, which is a leader in making starch. Uh, and quite interestingly, all of the low-fat yogurt that we have uh, has starch. So there is a lot of growth uh, in that area. Uh, and we also are expecting to see uh, some growth in the industrial biotech area in 2012. The UAE's healthcare sector is uh, worth billions of dollars. How are you uh, planning to cash in on this? What are your future plans? Well, the, the plans are that, uh, you know, for us to attract more companies that are in the health and biotechnology area to access this uh, growing market, I would say. And uh, we have seen um, really a lot of interest from the, the health and, and biotech areas. And the testimony to that is the numbers of companies that we have from those sectors. Looking forward to seeing that. Thank you very much, Marwan Abdulaziz Janahi, the Business Development Director of Dubaiotech at this year's Arab Health in Dubai.